Hello, all. Oh, welcome back to High Priest Reacts to Marble Hornets Entry Fifty. Wait, hold on. <laughs> am I on the? Am I on the right one here? Fifty three. I, I I hit about to start fifty two again. I knew it was fifty three, but I swapped the swap, swap out right before we started. So fifty three to whatever I end up on. It'll probably be. Four or five of them, though. Depends on the length. If I get a bunch of shorter ones, I might squeeze one ex one or two extra in. I didn't see any real complaints. Uh, I did see a little tiny little drop of viewers. I mean, it's a big drop, technically, because I don't get a lot of views in general, but... You know. Doesn't make... It, uh, I can't really tell if it's because I changed this or just because in general. So, like I said before, I'd prefer to stream this stuff, but it's still going to be another uh, two or so months away. At least. Probably safer to say free at this point. I want to, like I said, I want to get some stuff first. Fixing the internet so I can stream is going to be a little pricey. So, yeah. Uh, so, this looks like it's working out. Uh, let's see. Before we start, uh, I mentioned before, I believe I mentioned before I was doing Metroid Prime. Uh, it's up and uploading as we speak. Or uploading. Ep the episodes are going live as we speak. Uh, I'd say I've got another two weeks at most. I'm not looking at it right now. I don't remember the exact number of episodes off the top of my head. Uh, of uploads after this. I think it's more like a week and a half, really, but still. Uh, before that one's out. But, I have already started recording Metroid Prime 2. That one's a blast, because I've done Move to Prime Hack. So if you're interested in those stuff, that, I recommend checking it out. But otherwise, uh... I just get this all set up. Boop. Takes a few moments. Entry 53. But yeah. Uh, I finally got that replacement mouse. Very helpful. After seeing Tim in the downtown area a few months ago, I wondered. I began to try and figure out why he was here and where I could find him again. Place is pretty far away from where we all lived when Alex received our orders. Really, I found both Alex and Tim here. Yeah, we should. We should get everybody in. Like moss to a flame. The building I saw Tim come out. It was an antique store. But when I was, it was going out of business, so it was usually closed. I had to wait a few weeks for the store before I could talk to anyone that worked there. I was just wondering if you have seen a guy come in here. He's probably about my age. He's got dark hair, sideburns. You know, have you seen anyone in here recently like that? Yeah, I see a guy that comes in here like that. He's, sometimes he comes in when he's uh, looking for his, I think he has a doctor's appointment. Okay. Um, do you know where he might be going? Um, well, I don't know. There's a doctor's office down the street, so... Maybe. Right down the street? Okay. All right. Um, thank you. Mm -hmm. You're welcome. Now we got to looking around what's in there to see, see what might be interesting. What draws them in? The only down the street for the turn out to be a mental health clinic. Ah. I think I got that email so I can do stuff like, say, Prime Hack. 
Or for my own personal playthrough stuff. Sorry about that at the previous stream. There's no way that it was uh, so I can think of the way I said the thing on show up. Yeah. Coming back every day for the past week. Damn. Uh, or playing Skyrim in my own time. Very good to have a freaking fun fully functional mouse, let alone one with all the buttons necessary to help me do stuff. Hey, hey, Tim, Tim. hey uh, you're uh, Tim, right? Yeah. Uh, it's uh, it's Jay. Jay, do you remember me at all? Mm, you don't? No. Okay, okay, well, uh, remember, uh, uh, I helped you, or like you helped. We you and I both, like, we helped Alex Crayley with the student film Marble Hornets, like, a few years ago. You remember yeah, that? Yeah, kind of. That was kind of a long time ago, wasn't it? What are you doing around here? Uh, well, you know, I'm, I'm glad I ran into you because, remember, uh, I told you a while back that I wanted to finish it for him because, you know, I didn't want all his work to go to waste. If you're, uh, you know, okay. if, you're, yeah, if, if um, you're still interested in it, we should, yeah, like... Yeah, sure. Um, can we talk about it some other time? Because I'm really late for my doctor's Oh, visit. yeah. Yeah, I'll, uh, I'll talk to you some other time. Oh, that's the TSC bullshit it up to... I mean, you had a week, but I suppose you just didn't know what the fuck would happen when you actually talked to him. And so I just waited for him to come out. Come back out. Hey, Tim. Oh, hey, yeah, sorry. I didn't know you were going to be waiting outside, otherwise I would have tried to, like, pick up the pace in there a little bit. Oh, no, I mean, I wasn't, wasn't like, uh, wasn't sitting outside waiting on you or anything. I was in the area anyway, so I just figured I'd stop by here real quick and see if I could catch you on your way out. Okay, fair enough, I guess. Yeah, uh, uh, I didn't, like, ask you this oh, before, but is, every, is everything okay with you? Like, you know, okay? uh, yeah, you know, just more the usual. Uh, I mean, I just saw you going into the that clinic, so... <laughs> is everything okay with you? What the fuck just happened? Oh, okay. I accidentally pressed the keyboard button. Hello? Like, I mean, I just saw you going into the that clinic, so... <laughs> oh, this is just... Is everything okay with God, you? I don't like yeah, you, I mean, you know, you're doing just okay? having some... Social awkward months ago, but you know, talking. Everything seems to be going pretty good now. Okay, so you're doing it's fine. my yeah. Yeah. Cool. on uh, edge. Sits me on edge every time yeah, I hear uh, it. About fiction. I don't like it. I don't you know, like it. It's still interested. not bad. Uh, I just oh, okay. sits me off. It's hello. Oh, yeah. Cool. It's, it's never fun. <laughs> yeah, sure. I'll be right over. Okay, bye. Sorry, I was work. I gotta go. But uh, you got my number, right? Uh, no, actually, can you give it to me real yeah, quick? Yeah, yeah, sure. Or I'll just just give me yours and I'll put it in here. Okay. Uh, it's too. Alright, seriously. Uh, I can't exactly blame him because God knows I'd be even more floundering in uh, such a situation. But yeah, I got it. Okay, cool. Well, uh, I guess I'll just give you a call whenever I get off work or something. Okay. Yeah, I'll uh, I'll talk to you then. He's not gonna call you. <laughs> that was a deflection, sir. Okay, now mosey on. Stop, stop trying to act like you're fucking doing anything else on me. So I decided to keep acting like I need help to finish Marble Hornets. It's what I did when I met him back in Interfere. I stick with that story. After Tim left, I stayed in downtown for a while longer to look around. Just. Just, I don't know what it is, but it's just one of those things that just fit. I just. Ugh. Hello? Uh, hey, Jay, it's, uh, it's Tim. Hey, what's up? Uh, you know, same old stuff, I guess. Listen, um, I just remember this, but I, I remember Alex had me shoot, like, some, you know, behind the scenes footage type stuff while we were making that movie, and, um, I. I think I was supposed to give them back, but I don't think I ever did. So okay. I might still have them lying around somewhere. So if you want me to try and like 
find those, I'd be more than happy to just give them to you or whatever. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. If you can, uh, if you can find them, I'll take them. I'm sure I can use them for uh, for something. Okay, cool. Um, yeah, like I said, I'm not entirely sure where they are right now, but um, if you'll give me a That's little a bit good to find them, then I'll let you know. Okay, yeah, just just let me know. All right, cool. Um, I guess I'll uh, talk to you later. Uh, yeah, okay, yeah. Bye. Yes. It's not as bad as before, but that moment when it was all fresh and he had he, he wasn't fully prepared. Here he's bullshitting, but he, he's still awkward from bullshitting and such, trying to find, figure out what to do and say say correct. But just that is like outright. Oh, I thought I was finished my own face, but I guess Tim has a few more. I don't know if there'll be any use, but I'll take whatever lead that whatever that might lead me to see some answers. Again, I that shit sets me off. That shit sets me off bad. It's I don't know what it about it, it is, but every time I see it in a show or whatever, when you get that re reach that one peak peak uh, social awkwardness, it just like oh, it's like, <laughs> but it always does. Ugh. It, I mean, it, it legit. It took. I have to remind myself so times not to take my headphones off and just let the scene play out. That 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 is how much that shit affects me. Sometimes. I mean, I'd go back and watch it, but it's just, I wasn't expecting it and was not prepared. And it definitely slows down my watching experience don't, during those moments. I don't like them. I don't know why it sets my, sets me off so bad. But overall, yeah, that, was, that was a good one. Uh, so, Ken barely seems to remember their previous interactions. He definitely doesn't seem to remember any of the horrible shit that was going on. Yeah. Uh, definitely affected by it, given he has a... What was it, a weekly appointment with a mental health? <laughs> yeah, a weekly appointment. Which... <laughs> it, 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 people involved with it definitely need it, <laughs> given what's going on. But and of course we discovered that he had a few tapes himself. And I wonder what that'll trigger. I know the next one's the Tot Tothark one called uh, Reminder. I think it's Reminder. We'll, we'll we'll see. We'll see. I'll just straight up go to it. Reminder. Yep. Let's see. What are you reminding of, Todd Hark? Do you remember me? Ah! When Tim was poking in. God, okay. I have not forgotten. It's Mass Tim, which I, I'm absolutely supposed to have a different personality than main Tim. Okay, what was that? Get old friends, slow down. We're at one tenth speed. Yeah, no, I, that, that that mostly that's that I, I can't make anything out of that image, but oh, 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 wait, no, go back, go back. Reminder. But I think that's, you know, cause that, that, that's the way this makes sense to me. Pe the people in mass, whatever the fuck they are, whoever the fuck they are, seem to be a, if not a separate consciousness, then a separate set of memories of, for the same consciousness. Uh, to deal with the Slindy shit, whatever the fuck it exactly is.
again, it's fascinating to see the granddaddy of all these YouTube horror stories and, and where it all came from. Entry 54, proper now. Oh, yeah, that was so good. It does actually remember who he is. It has not Freon, even if Tim has. The only calling thing, he found his old tapes. Good, I was wondering, I was about to wonder if we were doing something else while he, while we waited for Tim to find out somebody to come uh, during his break from work to get them. Hey. Hey, Jay. Here's, uh, here's those tapes I was telling you about. Okay. So, what's the deal with all this stuff? What stuff? You know, the whole pointing your camera at everybody's face. Oh, uh, I'm just, you know, trying to trying to document this whole this whole process of getting all of Alex's stuff back together and finishing this movie for him, you know? Okay. Uh, are you making some kind of behind-the-scenes feature or something? Something like that, yeah. Okay. Uh, what's, um, what are on those tapes? Oh, I don't know. I wasn't able to watch them. I'm, you know, I'm... I'm not the movie guy, so I don't have a camera that'll play those kind of tapes. Ah, uh, okay, right, they're all play those. Shoot them on. Oh, uh, Alex lent me one of his cameras to... But you don't have that anymore, you know, so... Keep me out of his hair, I guess, so okay. I wouldn't bother him. I gave the camera back, but not the tapes for some reason, but I guess okay. they're yours now. All right, so, uh, yeah, well, uh, with them. thanks, uh, thanks again for, for helping me finish this. Well, I mean, I'll help however much I can, but I mean, if you couldn't already tell, my work schedule's kind of packed, but, I mean... If you really think this movie's worth finishing, then yeah, I guess just give me a call or something. Okay, yeah. Yeah, I, I think it's worth finishing, so I'll, right. I'll, I'll watch these. I'll, I'll call you. Yeah. All right. Yeah. They're a bit of a weirdo with the camera, much like Alex was. <laughs> or if Alex is actually freaking... But still. It's gonna weird out people who aren't fully aware of what's going on. So I don't know what it's like. It's mainly about the same style footage. Way more was being shot. I'm trying they, they're all numbered and without dates. Of course. I'm gonna stand for the first one I watched. I really do wonder where this is going to end. I don't expect it to end happily. Yeah, I got it. What happened? That sounds like they ran from something. Well, that was, uh, <sighs> exciting, I guess is the word. That was fun. Oh, yeah. Pouring rain. Awesome. Mm. Have you seen Alex? Oh, um, he said he was gonna run home and change shirts, because obviously he's kind of soaking right now, but he said he was gonna be back in a little bit, so... Unless you want to wait for me. <laughs> All right. I'll see you. See ya. Well, we certainly have a reason to be here anymore either since we're, I guess, we're done. All right. So, yeah, I think we're just uh, going to be like wrapping it up back yeah. here, so. I will. All right, see ya. see ya. We're here in scenic Tim's apartment uh, in his music room, complete with box of thing. Maybe musical masterpiece things with our hands. Ukulele with Tim attachment. I just learned this. Ukulele with Tim attachment. Okay, that's complete with beats. I define song pretty loosely right now because this is this is atrocious. Why am I holding the camera? <laughs> because you're the movie guy. You be the behind the movie guy. A little bit more on topic. Uh, oh, there's Brian. What's up, dude? That's a nice towel you got there. Oh, thanks. That's a nice. That's a nice hair you got. Um, my hair holds. Mm. That's why I'm the star. <laughs> yeah, people just shooting the shit, um, talking. But trying to pass time. Over the footage, and I think we have enough now to where we can start putting together our trailer. Trailer. And I've been thinking about music. I think I want to go more along the acoustic lines. So, do you want to help record some stuff, maybe with the ukulele? Or I could probably do that. I mean, I got this ukulele like a week ago, so I can't exactly promise that I'd be very good at it, but I can always try. Well, you have a, what I assume is some sort of guitar thing. You so can. Is it gonna be like? Is it gonna be like this dark? Be significantly more lighting. Okay. Well, I also like to be able to see, so I'm gonna go try and find the breaker box. I don't even know where it is. I never had to use it before. Ow! And I cut the power one nope. out. 
I'm not making anything out in the dark, but it... But the power going out while they're doing this shit is, uh... Well, never mind. Well, <sighs> never mind again. Some sort of guitar thing. You can... No, 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 we're going back to seeing that. Before. Ow! Nope. I heard a thing. I have to. Now, I mean, that was obviously Lindy mixed with their power, but still. Well, never mind. <laughs> there it is. It. Oh, hey. Well, I wonder why this is the most replayed moment in the video. Very telling. Well, everybody else oh knows my. what I know is too. Blurry as fucking possible. Just right there. That's why I heard the noise. The moment I knew that, I, he had to be on screen somewhere. I just wasn't sure where until, boom, the second pass through where I saw that in the stink to lurk. And it's a little bit easier to make out. Let's go even more slow mo. Man, is this plugin useful for this shit? There we go. 0.07 seconds. We're going ultra slow to get a good idea what this looks like. God, I love that doing that shit. It really does help with this, just being able to. No, seriously, uh, boom. He just turned around and completely fucking missed it. Good old speed controller. Never mind again. Fucker turned out their powers. I mean, their power, uh. There we go. How do I add an extra S there? I, I don't see him in the dark. Great. Power's just... There's something moving in the dark, but I can't make out details in any way, shape, or form. Good news, guys. We have flashlight. Even better news. Guess what's battery powered? Oh, this day just got so much better. Well, hey, about the acoustic <laughs> soundtrack. I guess that's the only choice we have now. So, um, jam session. Yeah. Sound cut there. I'm we going to. On Alex here. We have now. So, um, jam session. Yeah. I don't see him in the doorway or anything, but he probably is there. I just... It's hard to make out the details. Let me get a good lighting on Alex. Uh, I'm not in with enough to, to stop taking screenshot. Never mind, he moved in the frame. I was about to say, do one of those things where people will stop taking a screenshot and then increase the bloom to make out higher details. Oh, he just blitzed in there. Yeah, the tape just ends there. What the fuck happened? How the fuck that happened? Why isn't everybody dead? So that's the weirdest thing. Like, Sunday is just straight up at going, hitting people. Whoop, 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 whoop. It's just straight up hitting people now. Just bursting in hyper speed, attacking. And none of them are ending up dead. What the fuck? It's clearly after them. But this is a big difference from the earlier stuff where he just lurked in a fucking corner 
or watch them ominously. The fuck? Well, here's the K yet. As it's brought up. This one is dated. 4 2010, 4 p.m. 4 4 p.m. This looks like Sunday doing something to someone. You caused this. Caused what? Alex to kill that guy? You will never be forgiven. Alex, he, he will lead me to he, he will lead me to you. Lead me to death. Lead me to the Ark. Oh, a bunch of numbers I ain't going to. Oh. Extra cre creepy, uh, white glowy eye dude, of course. Yeah, I'm not even going to try to decipher those numbers. Everything else that w was at a quick and slow enough pace I could make it out. I have nothing. I have no idea what the fucking arc could be or the deaths or who they're talking to. Are they talking to, you know, our main character? Are they talking to Alex? Slindy? Is it Slindy talking about he's going to kill someone? Is it Tim talking about how he's going to kill someone? Is he talking to Alex watching these videos? Because, like, if he's posting these videos, there's no way Alex isn't fucking watching these things. That's the biggest conceit. He's posting this in universe, and people are no noticing. But how the fuck is. Well, I suppose Tim wouldn't know, which is probably a bit. Or is he waiting for more of a bigger delay than I, what I think? I mean, it's probably lucky he never up was uploading any of those videos when he was dealing with uh, Alex. Because posting some of those while he was dealing with them would have uh, alerted the dude a lot earlier. I'm just... Who is being talked to there? I'm sure those numbers would be mixing super clear, and the uh, date would be super helpful. If I could even remember when this fucking thing uh, was posted. In fact, uh, let me just pop open this. So, a few years before this was 2010. Right, right. I don't get it. But maybe it'll make more sense over time. But until then, entry 55. This is a short one, so... A lot of these were actually fairly short. The following tape footage is taken from another one since they look like they shot at a place near the end of the day shoot. Hey, Alex, the other day when you were talking about needing that's, a abandoned that's location probably the for Brian's what is school, like, after? in the movie, did you ever Outside find anything? Outside of being ominous and I, bad, no, what is he doing no, to people, and what is he after ultimately after? He didn't just straight up, like, so some horror. Okay. Uh, well, the reason that I asked was because there, there was, like, this old... Oh, well, he found you. He's gonna kill you now. looking kind of place He's back where I used to live. Something. Um, that might pass as a school. People are still uh, alive. If you want to go check it out, we can, Alex's but it's kind of far away. Or a well, servant. Some people like end up dead, really clearly. Well, I think it could pass as a school. Okay. Hell, I thought t Tim had it. Uh, well, ended up dead before. I haven't found anything around here. How far away is? Because we saw him at that one thing. Yeah, I completely forgot he had, had, had was alive long enough to, to be in the earlier tapes. Um, well, like I said, since interacting I with our main character. Shot, can you do Friday? I'm free all day. I actually have a doctor's appointment Friday at like two, but if you can do Saturday, that would be better. We uh, kind of have to make a weekend out of it anyway. I can do Saturday, uh, Brian. Since you're gonna have to be there anyway, can you do Saturday too? Well, uh, let's shoot for Saturday then, and uh, we'll give it a look. All right, sounds good to me. Uh, all you need to do is go stand by the uh, set. I'm on. Yeah. Not seeing any slender anywhere. Not hearing any. 
any extra noise. All right, that'll be good. Hey, yeah, uh, get me on here. I need to do something real quick. All right, I'm back. They're just filming shots at this point. It's hard to figure out what information is important in these that doesn't directly di relate to everything, but I'm sure for a lot of people. Like, what even was this movie supposed to have been about? Hello? Yep, Friday at 2. I'll be there. Headaches, paranoia, trouble sleeping. Head I haven't had a headaches, full night's sleep in paranoia, weeks. Trouble sleeping. Well, I've shit. kind of had some history with this kind of thing before, but I'd rather not talk about that over the phone if that's okay. Hmm? Oh, right, so he had some, in some issues with mental health before all this, too. Or how that complicates. Sorry. What Slendy's doing? No mention of his symptoms. They sound similar to what they're experiencing throughout shooting Marble Hornets. Oh. Plus, that what he's trying to be the only thing that eventually led to this. Yeah, yeah. The him just wearing a mask and doing doing that shit. All you see left. I'm going to finish going through this as soon as I can. So what happened that made made him unconscious and have to be had his body dragged places? Entry fifty six. We're gonna keep talking though. What the hell happened with Tim and shit back then? Now? Was he just knocked unconscious? Why? And this brings up the possibility that either A, he would just, you know, had problems, or B. M was already being followed by Slenderman. That he had some previous instance with the entity, and it was him who brought uh, Alex and the others to Slenderman's attention via recording. If they caught, kept catching him in his lurking. If so, that is interesting. Interesting. Yeah, I was assuming they just start filming in places they shouldn't, some of those things, but. That brings up an entirely other possibility. Why is whatever happening to Tim different from what's happening to Alex? Maybe Entry 56 will shed light on it. I doubt it, though. But let's start into it. It has been a short one, so I, I think I'll do another one after this. Honestly. Oop, oop. I'm done to the last couple of Tim's tapes. The following I just taken from the next last one. I didn't read it. <laughs> Actually read that when it came on screen. Uh... Oh, hey. The train tracks. I almost thought you'd given up on this place since it's been so long since I told you about it. Yeah, stuff came up. That happens. Are you actually going to be filming anything today? No, I'm not going to shoot anything without Brian here. Okay, when's uh, he supposed to get here? Well, he'll be here tomorrow, and Seth will be here later today. All right, so we're just kind of doing preliminary location scouting. Yeah. Works for me. Yes, and say that this is it. Uh, yes, that would be a uh, correct guess. Um, let's see, if I remember correctly, I think it's three floors, a basement, might be able to get up on the roof, so we can just kind of go in and take a look around if you want to. Yeah, all right. What is this creepy ass place? How many graffiti on the first floor? Creepy so abandoned places. I'm not sure are. how much of that you'd be able to use. As you can see, definitely not the uh, 
I thought this was what, like, what is this, the house? That one medical place, but no, this is a different one. Ugh. Now, the answer is, it, the question is, is there anything to do with Sunday here? I said answer is. Let's see. I'm not seeing anything. Not even his mark. Yeah, but it's just like an annex. Nothing special. This place is way better. No, let's go. I want to see it. <clears throat> well, I'm kind of not sure if I feel like I'm up to going to another place. If you don't mind. I do mind, because there is no way this place could pass for a school. I'll just go over there with Seth and get switched. Fine with me. Wait, that, that's the skull you were filming. I mean, compared to the rest the of this place, the skull that shit happened. doesn't really have a whole lot of graffiti in it. Okay, so I know where that relates to things it. now. Oh, this is right before that incident, where Alex pulled the shit on him. Yeah. I saw it. I mean, unless you're okay with having like, it. I saw it. You'd probably use it at some point. Don't you think? There we go. Don't you think? His symbol right there. Don't you think? Yeah. Why did that shit go I mean, down? Okay with having, like, all of them in the school. Nancy thing? Hart's Kevin on the wall or something. And how did that happen? So we're going upstairs things. or downstairs? Let's go up. Okay, well, the stairs that go up are all the way over there, but we can do that. I thought that school was a doctor's place. Somewhere in my memory pinged on it that way more than fake school. Uh, he looked out a window. I need to stop and see. That might be him out there, but it looks more like just a dark bit of wood. Yeah, no. It's like every time you look out a window, I absolutely have to make sure because maybe this he's room down like here will be uh, more to your liking. So I'm not exactly sure what you're really looking for, but this dude, maybe. I don't know. Okay. Well, uh, there has to be some room in this place that you like somewhere. Because this place isn't exactly tiny. I gotta take a leak. Hang on. Alright, who's gonna pop their head out of the woodworks this time? He walks off camera, leaves it sitting there. Something's happening off screen, or... fucking attacked him. This isn't even the other place. He just fucking started attacking him while he was taking a taking, uh, and yeah, yeah, it falls down and reveals, uh, Slindy was uh, in a different part of the room the entire time. How many times has, it, had Tim had his shit kicked in and he then just forgotten it? I'm starting to feel like he's, he's, he, he's Worf. It's his job, or Yamsha. It's his job to get his ass kicked. And dude just walks away, throws down his stick and walks off. Leaving Tim there. And then Tim comes back with a camera and takes it. <laughs> that is distorted. And Tim's coughing.
that's just generally what the fuck. It's a pattern I've noticed. Him get the shit kicked out of him so fucking much in this. Why? Why is he the one that uh, Alex always beats the shit out of? But Tim never seems to fucking remember it. Why hasn't he just gone for the kill? Because we know he'll make Alex kill a dude. If it Tim. Weird, I don't get it. And why does, when Tim does fucked up shit, he does it in a mask, and Alex just fucking does it as himself. Entry 57. Yeah, we went for another one. These are shorter than the other ones, so I feel like I could I could pack more. I'm so glad it seems last Tim makes up after Alex attacked him. Good. We can finally see whatever the fuck happened after these shit. After this shit. He reload. He just quietly reloaded it in the middle of the night. <laughs> Coughing with a, a vastly worse cough than he had earlier. And I can't even tell if he's f fully aware what the fuck's going on. That's out the fact he needs to load the camera and leave. Can he talk? And of course, the night vision mode is dark, pitch dark enough that it's hard to even so much as see the glimpse of something. That's the way it's not, it's not, it's not like that. He's trying to get out of here quickly, so some sense of self preservation. The, the, the big thing is that Alex definitely came across less of a douchebag earlier on, but as time went on, he went became a douche, started acting like a douche, and I'm not, I like Tim, who when, when he acts different than when he has the mask on. Alex seems to just be permanently set to do the murderous douche canoe, and just pretending. Is he Todd Hark? Is Alex Todd Hark? I was thinking the mask guys might have been... Hot heart, but now I'm wondering. <laughs> Jesus Christ, that's a walk to make. He had to walk down out, well, all while cough, probably coughing up blood from being attacked. We don't see it. Just unconscious until the middle of the night. And having to walk all night. Something's fucking with the camera. There's someone with a light. Now someone fuck with the camera. Someone's got a flashlight. Or oh, wait, no, that might have been a car driving by. I'm not so sure. Thought that was visual glitch. Then realized it was a light. Was that just a car driving by, or someone walking around with a flashlight looking for someone? Jesus. Wait, where the fuck is he now? He go back inside? He not even leave really leave? Did he just go outside before wandering back in? Fuck are you going, Alex? Yeah, Alex, Tim. Why the fuck are you going? You were outside, couldn't you just leave? 
again, I don't even know how fully aware he is. Is this just like barely there, conscious of the world? I haven't seen Slindy anywhere. Did Alex come back to try to finish the job? Yeah, he's probably bleeding and everything. You can't make out any details because of the lack of light in the night vision. <laughs> Shit. He got found, at least by Slindy. He was trying to muffle his cough so he could escape. That's Tim's last tape in there. What the fuck? It looks like the same one. Oh. So this isn't when he got his... Okay, so this isn't when he tried to kill him in the other building. Beat the shit out of him and left him unconscious in the other building. This is... It's not like he really... Went, But he got attacked, then got up, went to this building. When he was trying to hide, or, uh, or oh, was he just trying to hide in that building, or was there something that? What the fuck? Yeah, no. So this looks like it's after he got unconscious and dragged briefly away, but this is after the event. But after the event, so yeah, he was being the shit out of by the dude during that. If it helpful, he still remembers where this place is. He can show it me in entry fifty six. Was entry 56 and 51 part, part of the same thing? It, it can't be. He just randomly beat the shit out of him there, but then they went to that other building, and it doesn't look like they were connected because he clearly stated he didn't want to go to that other building. And this was before. Okay, I'm trying to figure out the timeline of events here. I want you to put about a chronological uh, entry uh, thing. That would be super neat. Hopefully someone did. Cause I'm definitely going to need someone to explain this shit to me because I am fucking lost. I think 57 is a good stopping point he for here. Uh, we, we made a little pro quite a bit of progress for it. But God, Tim is just... Him is Alex's punching bag, the way this is going. I just don't even know. Hmm. It is curious. Curiosa and Curiosa. Because now I'm tr I, I, I'm truly confused on how that worked out. That's but how is Tim still alive? Flat out, how the fuck is he still alive? 
And what the fuck is going on? I'm super curious. I definitely want to find out eventually, but I'm going to end up stopping for now. This is pretty signing out, and I will see you all next time, folks. <laughs>